Come on down to Tooley Town You'd better make it quick The garage is just opening It's time for Mechanic From an ancient penny farthing To a racing car that's sick He's the man to get you moving He's the Mega Mechanic Mechanic, Mechanic Mechanic, Nick, Nick. The sun was shining and all was peaceful at Thule Garage. Mecha Nick was quietly humming while he worked on Professor Aubrey Bolingbroke's favourite car. The professor was showing M a book of pictures. These are called collage pictures because they're made of bits and pieces. Lucy, M's mum, was busy typing in the office. And Austin, who owned the garage and looked after Em and Lucy, was snoring away. But the peace was not to last. Oops! Oh, Spanner! You naughty dog! Professor, Spanner set the alarm off! What's that? I, I can't hear you, dear boy. Spanner set the alarm off! Get off, Spanner! There's a big hole in your exhaust pipe, Professor. Oh, fiddle-faddle. I'm afraid you'll need a new one. We need a new exhaust pipe for the Professor's car, Austin. Oh, dear. We've run out and the parts people can't deliver one today. Their van's broken down. Sorry, Professor. Fiddle-faddle. What time is it? Half past one. Oh, no. I have to open the Thule Science Exhibition at two o'clock, uh, so I've only got, um, ooh, um, 30 minutes. Don't worry, Professor. I'll take the truck and pick up your exhaust myself. You know what I always say? Where there's a wheel, there's a way. Oof. <gasps> Professor! Are you all right? Oh, I'm just a little... Tired. Oh, my goodness, Professor Aubrey. Oh, thank you. Oh, but the science exhaust emission, the exhaust. Don't worry. Nick's got everything under control. Yes, don't worry, Professor. You just have a nice cup of tea while you wait. I'll go and get your new exhaust right now in my truck. Oh, dear. Sorry, Nick. What are you going to do now, Nick? Hmm. Don't rush me. I'm thinking. Oh, no exhaust, no truck, no science exhibition. Just as all seemed lost, rescue was at hand. It's Moose! It's Moose! Moose was Nick's best friend and always ready to help. Oh, Moose! We've got an emergency! How can I help? The professor needs a new exhaust pipe. Him or the car? The car, silly. And, and he's been hit by a tyre and he has to open the science exhibition, but the windscreen on Nick's truck is broken. Whoa, whoa, no, slow down, slow down. Exhaust, tyre, windscreen, exhibition. Well, that's simple. How? Professor? Oh, my. Have you ever been through Thule on a motorbike before, Professor? No. You get to see the whole town. Look! There's the cinema with seven screens, the skating rink where I've never been, some smallish shops, and I buy my jeans from that one. The bowling alley, the football ground, the studios of Thule Sound, the car park store, I'm often found in that one. There's the cattle market, old town hall, the law courts pond and waterfall, the pizza place he'll often call and get one. Oh, the big store where they just sell toys, the school that's packed with girls and boys. It's break time, so there's lots of noise. It's great fun. Uh, weren't we supposed to stop at the town hall? Oops. Thanks, Moose. Got to run. The professor made it to the science exhibition right on time.
There's chalk that talks, there's a fork that walks, a dancing television. There's a pie with eyes and a tie that flies at the exhibition. There's a nose that glows, silly clothes for toes, welly boots with vision. There's a king with wings and string that sings at the exhibition. Which I now declare open! In no time at all, Moose, Nick and the Professor were back at the garage, mission accomplished. How was the exhibition, Professor? Very... musical. <laughs> I'll soon fix this, Professor. No problem. In next to no time, Nick had fixed the exhaust on the Professor's car and the Professor was ready to leave. But there was another problem. Nick, dear old chap, it's this pedal. Every time I press it, this happens. <laughs> oh dear, it sounds like you're going to need a new clutch. We used the last one yesterday, Nick. But I've got to sing the official opening of Thule Art Exhibition at four o'clock. It's all right, Professor. I know what the problem is, and it's easy to fix. Spanner? <laughs> it was just Spanner's toy rat. Phew! Bye, everyone. Thanks a million. And that's the end of the tale. If your roller skates or minibus need mending, take your pick. But of all the men to help you, you'd do best with mechanic. 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 Mechanic, Nick, Nick.